the Tesla Optimus humanoid robot was already seen as a groundbreaking leap toward bridging industrial automation with everyday robotics. Powered by Tesla's AI and trained on years of neural network data from self-driving cars, Optimus Gen 2 gave the world a first real glimpse of what a mass-produced humanoid assistant could look like. But in early 2025, Tesla unveiled Optimus Gen 2.5, and this update makes it clear that Tesla is moving at a pace few could have predicted. Instead of waiting years between major breakthroughs, Tesla is iterating in months, and the results are stunning. Before we dive into the key upgrades, if you love staying ahead of Tesla and AI robotics, make sure to hit subscribe now. You'll always be the first to know the breaking news. The biggest upgrade from Gen 2 to Gen 2.5 is in the hands. Gen 2 had a functional design with 11 degrees of freedom, capable of lifting up to 25 kilograms, opening doors, or handling basic objects. But it lacked fine motor skills, more like a mechanical gripper than a true human hand. Gen 2.5 changes that dramatically. Tesla upgraded the hands to more than 22 degrees of freedom, nearly doubling articulation. This allows Optimus to perform delicate tasks like typing, sorting small components, gripping fragile items, and even replicating subtle human gestures. It's the difference between a robot that can just hold and one that can truly manipulate like us. Vision has also improved. Optimus Gen 2 was equipped with a strong front-facing camera system, but it left blind spots behind. The robot often had to rotate its entire body just to scan its environment. Gen 2.5 solves that problem with a rear-mounted camera, giving Optimus nearly 360 degrees of vision. Combined with Tesla's self-driving AI architecture, this makes the robot more natural and aware, able to sense people approaching from behind, avoid obstacles, and respond from every angle in real time. The design has seen an evolution as well. The Gen 2 prototype carried Tesla's classic black and white look, futuristic, but uniform. Now, Gen 2.5 introduces sleek new finishes, including an all-black model and a striking gold edition. The black version is perfect for professional and security roles, while the gold variant projects luxury and sophistication for public spaces. Tesla clearly understands that robots won't just be tools. They'll be part of human environments, where appearance matters. Charging has also changed. Gen 2 relied on a proprietary docking system that was hidden but inflexible. Gen 2.5, on the other hand, now uses Tesla's North American charging standard, the same plug as its vehicles. That means the same infrastructure powering your Tesla car can now charge your Tesla robot. It's a small change, but one with massive implications for scalability and integration. Taken together, these upgrades may sound incremental, but in reality, they represent a huge leap forward. Unlike traditional robotics companies that take years between updates, Tesla iterates at the speed of its vehicles, fast, continuous, and bold. Gen 2 laid the foundation. Gen 2.5 is the transition point, bringing human-like hands, full field vision, aesthetic customization, and charging integration. And if this is only the halfway point, imagine what Gen 3 could bring next year. So what do you think? Is Optimus Gen 2.5 a small step or a giant leap toward the future? Share your thoughts in the comments below. Thanks for watching Robo Frontier. If you enjoyed this breakdown and want to stay ahead on the future of AI and robotics, hit like, subscribe, and turn on the bell icon so you never miss an update. The future of humanoid robots isn't coming, it's already here.